Now that we're able to get an app token, it should be easy to register an achievement. Let's finish up our register achievement page and go ahead and register our achievements with Facebook. So here's the achievements page on the developer site. And you can see if you scroll down a little bit that in order to create an achievement, we have to issue an HTTP post to app ID slash achievements with an app access token, which we now have, and the following parameters. Two parameters. Number one is the achievement, which will be the URL to the achievement. And then the second one is the display order, which is the order that the achievement will display whenever it comes up on the app. Achievements with a lower display order will be displayed before achievements with a higher display order. So let's go ahead and let's open up our register achievement page, which we worked on in the last movie. So I'm going to go ahead and open that up. And first thing I need to do is get our register achievement function. This is exactly what the JavaScript API requires. It sends a post command, which is right there, to the URL, which will need our app ID instead of this your app ID, obviously slash achievements, and it's going to send along a couple of variables, display order, and then when it gets a response from the server, if the response is an error, it'll print that out. If it's not an error, then it means everything went fine, and it will display a message into our div that we created before. So I'll copy this, come over here, and I don't really need to worry about where I put that because it's going to be executed when I click on a button. So there's the register achievement function. And I'm going to go over here into our Facebook developer page and get the app ID. I'll paste it right there. I'll save this. And then I just need to have a button somewhere on my screen that allows people to register the achievement when they go to it. So underneath my diff for message, I'll paste that. Save that, and then I'm going to go to my register app page. Uh, let's see, hold on, I'm probably missing something else. So what I want to do is I got my app ID here. I want to make sure that I update the URL that this is going to register every time. So when I click on this button, it's going to pass along a URL. The URL that it will pass will be right here. So I'll need to type in something instead of achievement name and type in the URL for one of my achievements. I view source.com, Facebook, slash, and then achievement new b.php. Now that one, I want to make sure that it register with the lowest display order. So you do want to make sure you update this whenever you change it to a new one. Just to make sure, I'm going to copy this URL and put it in a browser to make sure it's pointing to the right place. Looks like my newbie achievement title came up, so I know that's a good one. Let's see what else. I don't need to alert this anymore, so I'm going to delete that right there. Save this and pull up our register achievement.php page. So I should see the button for register. And if I click on this, if I did everything correctly, it'll say thanks. This achievement has been registered with Facebook. So now what I need to do is just modify this. I will change the display order to be two and put in the address for sharing.php. Save this, go back into Safari, refresh my page, hit the register button. Let's wait a second, looks like it got registered just fine. Back into BB Edit. Last one is the Kung Fu. And I'll make it a display order of three. Save it again, come back into Safari, refresh, register, wait for the message, and there it is. Not terribly exciting, but if everything went as planned, we're now ready to display our achievements in our application.